ladies and gentlemen welcome back to the channel and um, before we get into the video guys on the day of recording this 12th of June um, the game Denmark Finland obviously got abandoned guys if you didn't know um, it got abandoned because Christian Eriksen went down um, after a, a full, a full sort of thing and he landed on his chest so it's also something to do with his heart and um, they had to give him CPR um, I'm not too sure on the situation of him but so far he is um, apparently hospital, I don't know if he's not in hospital yet but um, the game is abandoned because of that um, so before I get advice please comment down below just pray for X and um, you know hope he's okay I hope he's better um, by the time the video comes out really hope he does um, he's one of the best players I've seen um, he's great talent very good talent um, I mean as soon as, as, soon as it, Christian Exxon went down the ground, the player's reaction was instant, the see face were horrible scenes, I mean the, fa the faces of the, not just Denmark, fa the Denmark players, but the Finland faces as well, um, they're, you know, crying over the place, and uh, the referees well, quick, quick action to get the, the medics on to help them, you could see they were using the defibrillator on, um, you could see that, um, I hope he's okay, I hope he is okay, uh, but we'll move on to um, positive news, um, it's the first transfer news of the post Coglu era. Let me just fix the camera thing, guys. Um, the post era, and it's Matt Ryan. Um, could be the post could be post Coglu's first sign at Celtic. Um, Sky Sports have um, today provided a, a Saturday update on the Celtic interest in goalkeeper Matt Ryan this summer. Um, it was reported overnight by the Scottish Sun that Ryan could well be and Postacolo's first sign as Celtic boss. Sky also reported Celtic interest this afternoon. Uh, the club are said to be assessing goalkeeper options. They are now weighing up an offer for the Brighton player. However, no formal talks yet have been taking place. Now, uh, multiple clubs are chasing the signature. Um, this includes Arsenal, who had him in loan last season when he made three appearances. Now, a very good source on Twitter, Anthony Joshua, very highly linked. I think part of the Sky Sports kind of transfer Scottish kind of group. He uh, said Celtic are weighing up a move for Brighton keeper Matt Ryan. They're assessing goalkeeper options and Ange Postacoglu is keen on Ryan. No formal talks have been taken yet. Sky Sports and something else has reported yesterday that Arsenal and clubs in France and Spain are also keen on Matt Ryan. So it's going to be interesting. They're assessing goalkeeper options now. Does that mean Barkas is no longer going to be an option for Celtic and Matt Ryan obviously because he's a stew and he will link well with you know, he likes Ange Postacoglu real well because obviously Ange is also Australian as well. Will that, you know, Australian kind of thing work well with them? Um, I don't know, but I hope it does well. Um, so they're assessing good options. So you're talking, we've got right now Barkas, Bain, and Hazard. Obviously, Hazard's kind of younger, so um, they're talking maybe he's going to be the bench. You might get rid of Bain and Barkas, or get one of the two. So you get rid of Bain and keep Barkas, you know what I mean? As your backup, you know what I mean? With Hazard. Uh, it's kind of interesting news, you know, Matt Ryan down in Brighton, he's had qu quite a couple of good scenes with Matt Brighton and obviously went to Arsenal last season, didn't really see him there. He only made a few, three appearances for Arsenal. Um, it's going to be interesting, the summer chance for top, because, you know, we've got obviously a manager in now. He's actually going to be trying to get the players in, which is going to be interesting. Um, hopefully he gets the right players in. Hopefully the manager that is held as well. Um, yeah, it's just a wee bit of talk by us about... Matt Ryan and he is linked with Celtic and Celtic are eyeing up, um, eyeing up a move for him. Also, a couple of other players I've seen um, in the Japanese market I've seen because obviously Ange obviously, um, obviously managed over there, um, Marinos over there. So, uh, be interesting to uh, see what players he brings in. Um, we also heard that John Kennedy might not be at the club next season. Yes, come on. Um, well, hopefully, it does happen. And Gavin Stratton, give it them a Get, get Ange's Ange own backroom staff in because them two numpties there, oh god almighty. Um, hopefully, guys, you like the new setup. This is going to be a new setup now. Uh, Scotland flag for the Euros, obviously. Um, I can't wait for the Euros, man. Yeah, buzzing. Um, but before I end of it, guys, come on. Pray for X in here, come on. Um, I really hope he's better. Um, one of the best players um, I've seen. Um, he's a belly as well, man. Some player. Um, I'll, I'll end the video on that, guys. Hopefully, uh, Christian Exxon is better um, by the news breaks out by later on in the night. Hopefully, he does is better. Hopefully. Uh, I'll leave you on that, guys. Please subscribe and like. I'll see you next video. Peace.